Hey everyone, Shea Bear 1000 here. Today, my birthday present came in. Monkey and Monkey's mother got this for me. Well, they paid for it, but they let me pick it out because they know nothing about this kind of thing. So, we're going to open this up and we're going to check it out. Very exciting. I'm very excited. Should be a lot of fun. Okay guys, so what they got me for my birthday, they let me pick it out because, like I said, they don't know anything about this stuff. This is the Tyco Daredevil slot car racing set. Um, it's the Cliffhangers Daredevil. So it's got the track part that actually your car actually runs upside down. Um, the one I had when I was a kid was just the Cliffhangers. I believe this is a 1984 and it is I'm going to say 99% complete because it does have one car but apparently it doesn't work but everything else is there and I'll put a couple pictures up on the screen right now So as you can see, it was set up, so, uh, but our cars should run on this track. Oops. Very exciting. Very well packaged. <laughs> Here it is, guys. Let me bring you down a little bit here. Monkey's over here. She asked her if she wanted to be in the movie and she said later because we're she wants to race so she wants to do the fun stuff. All right. I may have to bring you down a little bit more. There it is. Original box. Box is decent. But he also sent me pictures of checking the track with a vote on vote ohm meter, multimeter, and uh, to show that the controllers were working and that the uh, the track did have power to it. Now I paid up for this one because it's in very good condition. And like I said, it's 99% complete. Look. Hmm. Very well packaged. Okay, so got the original paperwork here um, I should be able to find a date on here somewhere but he said it was an 84 and that's about right but this is all pieces here you could buy all this extra stuff back in the day so but usually there's a date on these Somewhere that you can find and give an idea. It might be on the box, but so for the controllers. This one of the cars. It is missing a front wheel. It looks like, and of course, you know the tires are bad. I'll give you close-up shots of this in a little while. But the picture I put up on the screen was this this active set set up in my matchbox set it came with one of these which don't go to the matchbox set this is a Tyco I have an extra one of these these things are selling for five bucks really yeah because I remember saying man that looks familiar 
Now I remember, this also jumps a ramp. Yeah. It goes up the wall, and again, it goes upside down. Looks like there's a little plastic piece there. I'll put that up there. But, so, I mean, that, that car may run, who knows? You just might be able to just buy a tune-up kit for it. <coughs> right. Get some tires and stuff. Mm -hmm. So we'll see. All the guardrail <coughs> pieces are here, but I think one of them has a broken tab. Wow. Yeah, I remember this game. <laughs> Figure out, you know, what goes where. And, oh. Anyway, there's that. These pieces. When you bought the set new, you had to put these pieces together. They came on like the spews and you break them off, put them all together. So, this should be cool. We may be getting another one, huh, Mom? Yeah. Haven't decided yet. So, but yeah, I think that's the one that's got the little tabs broke off. You can buy these things real cheap. They still make these. Okay. Yeah, you can buy them cheap. Okay. Wow. But if we get get the other one, two, it's the night glow, and you can set it up in four different configurations, and it's the same track as this. So if we get it, we could go. We could have it going into our mom's room. She'd be sitting there watching TV. Zoom, <laughs> Corvette go by. That'd be funny. Okay, so it, there's there's a piece of my stirrup. Thing, instructions, whatever. In fact, yeah, there's the instructions right there. And I'm looking at them upside down. It tells you everything. All the pieces here. It's 21 and a half feet of racetrack. <laughs> wow. So, yeah, you got A to Z on here. All right, so what I'm going to do is figure out exactly where I want to set this up at for the, uh, wow, that's in good shape, for the, uh, the controllers and the power. There's the power that you plug your controllers and power into. Uh, wow, this is... 21.8 volts. <laughs> so, so, yeah, this is the. <coughs> Alright, so, what we're going to do, let me just look a little bit back, but he had it set up because that's this in the picture, so. I'm going to start setting this thing up. And once we get it all set up, first thing we'll do is see if that car runs. If it runs, then I'll get some parts for this car because this is one of the original cars for this. It's missing the mirror, but. Um, cool. Yeah, because these things. See that car on there? Mm -hmm. But we've got the cars out of her dad's set. Yeah, see, they're the same way. And these cars do something neat we didn't know about until the other day, right, Mama? Yeah. So, yeah. Yep, yeah, same cars. <coughs> All right, let me... I'm going to spare you guys of me setting this up in fast motion and stuff because there may be a lot of cussing <laughs> but I'm not sure are we going to run up this wall or over there I don't know how tall is that uh, I don't know because <laughs> um, if you could do it right there you can open up the curtain and then just put it up that wall if it's only that big but if you if it's bigger, then you have to use probably the wall where the bar is. Let's see. 
see. It might make it under there. <laughs> we'll see. Hang tight, guys. I'm gonna get this put together. Okay, guys. I got it set up. I got the track clean, both sides, and now we can't run our cars around here with the bodies on because they're a little too heavy. The cars that came with this track have extra magnets in it, so and also. Me and Monkey's going to have a race, but I'm just going to put it in an old track <laughs> until she can get used to this. I got my catch pillow over there. fine a minute ago I'm sure I've still got some cleaning to do on the contacts here where they go together oh okay all right one of my springs popped out of the pickup so let me get that fixed just right there so let me get that fixed real quick. Okay, let's try this again. I warmed it up a little bit. And of course, this ran it like 15 laps. That's why I have my catch pillow there. Once you get it going, it's all right, but it's getting started. There we go. Oops, I was going too fast. It's coming in too hot. track and me and monkey can race okay so we put some turns in there we put the jump in monkey's running some hot laps to get used to it there's the jump we got quite a gap there it's jumping we got another one coming don't we monk yeah it's the night glow yeah that'll be fun That's yeah, the one these cars are supposed to what? That's still fire. Now you smell the oil from that thing. Oh, is that what it is? Yes. Oh, okay. I love that smell. You've heard me talk about it. I, I... Huh? Yeah. I smell fire. <laughs> oh, yeah. So we got another one coming night glow. These cars I figured out are for a night glow track. They're not for the Corvette Challenge 100. Because these, these cars glow in the dark, don't they, Mama? Yeah. I don't know. Let me turn some lights off and let's see. Ooh, yeah, look. Ooh, yeah. I can see it. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. 
Yeah, pretty cool, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So I'm gonna let her get used to it when I can hot wrap for a little bit. And then we'll be back with you when I... Oh! When we race, whoops, now I'm overexposed. Holy crap. When I, uh, kick her butt. Kick whose butt? Yours. Yeah, okay. Give it a little nudge. From the back. Push it forward. Easy. <laughs> Alright guys, I'll be back with you. Okay, I gotta sit back in this hole because <laughs> the track still needs to clean. But this we're not keeping track of the it's not really a race race. Just kind of a test and tune. You ready, Monk? Yeah. Let's go. So we're going to start doing an annual race, aren't we, Mom? Yeah. So we're going to have four tracks. And we'll do it over a few day period. Mm-hmm. Man, you went third of the last Chevron on that. <laughs> See that? That was pretty cool. Inside lane don't like to jump that jump for some reason. I got sticky, double side sticky tape here, but
Okay. That red card can fly. Yep. track of the right. laps and everything and like the winner will get to choose the track next time yeah. and lane choice so but yeah it just needs a little more cleaning up yeah it does and I think it'll be fine because it does hang up over here once in a while and, but I think it'll be fine yeah I mean look how old it is well it's 40 years old it is 1984 guys I checked it um, this came out of, a guy got it at an estate sale, and it came out of an attic or basement or something. I would say attic, because if it came out of a basement, depending on what shape the basement was in, you would think there'd be a lot more rust on here. But, uh, so, I'm thinking, I think he said attic, I can't remember, but, yeah. Um, so, yeah, 40 years old still running yep the car that came with it will be all right it just needs brushes and a wheel so that's cool and we'll get another car for it yeah the track we're getting needs two controllers but you know we've got four controllers so mm -hmm. you know yeah awesome now the fun part of putting this thing all back away <laughs> uh, okay guys so I didn't have my hat on. I got really, really hot. Yeah. So what do you think, Monk? You I like, like it? it? Yeah. yeah. I just wish we had a place where we could just set it up, but we don't. Want to set it up and leave it up? Yeah. Yeah, but I like changing around. Well, you can still change it around when you want. It's just not, you know. We just don't have the room to no. set it up and keep it set up. So. No, no. But that would be fine because we have other tracks and we can do... Do whatever we want. Yeah, so we'll have, what, four tracks? Yeah. <laughs> cool. Yeah. <coughs> what about the Matchbox one? Remember that one engine blew up, and the Monza, I think it's a Monza. I thought it was a Vet, but it's not. I think it's a Monza. Hmm. It, it needs tires, so we'll have to get that straightened out. Yeah. I got an idea how we can fix that. Yeah? What's that? This is something. Okay? So, let me get... You got a knife beside you, don't you? Right there. Yeah. Alright. Let's find out what's in this box. Did it come with the track? When did this come in? Monday. Yeah. So, when did the track come in? Today. Okay, so no, it did not come with the track. But, so the Matchbox one, because you can't run Matchbox cars on this track, and you can't run these cars on the Matchbox track. And Matchbox is the only one that has their own size. AFX, I think Aurora, they'll all run on this track and vice versa. But the uh, Matchbox cars, are, I think, are just a little wider, I believe. But so I think I think I've got a fix for the Matchbox track. Well, I got the track working. Remember? Mm-hmm. 
but really? <laughs> well, all that is holy. See, that's that's why I tell her every little thing, that's okay. and when I don't, that's what happens. You got cars. So I'll put a bit in on these things. There's the catch me car, the Monza. I think it's Monza. These came from New Jersey. Oh yeah. Yeah. I have a cousin who lives in New Jersey. They probably new. No. They I don't make it. these anymore. They're very well taken care of. they run but I do know they're they're complete mm -hmm. probably gonna need a little up because I'm spinning that axle on that again you can get tune-up kits for these mm -hmm. and what else we got here police car that blew up you talking about that yeah it was the first one I got going it was running real good yeah and then it, it, it blew up <laughs> yeah and I was gonna buy a couple motors and wheels and tires and, mm -hmm. and this came up I made an offer and here they are Look how nice shape that's in. Yeah. It was well taken care of. I just sat up on a shelf or something. I don't know. Mm. Now, see, these are th narrower, so they, they go inside, you know, they can't make contact. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And there's him one of them. <clears throat> see the difference? Mm -hmm. Pick up, see how wide those are and how narrow these are. Yeah. Yeah, so. But, <laughs> so this is my birthday present. Mm -hmm. Two. So, I'm guessing that maybe tomorrow, yeah, see this one's the gears turning. Mm hmm. Yeah. I don't know if the light works in it or not. You can buy lights for these too. But I see that gear turning. So on this one, the gear's not turning, it's not a big deal. It seems a little tight. But I figured, you know, oh look at the tires. Mm -hmm. Tires are in good shape. So yeah, I don't know if I can turn this sideways. Squeeze one of them triggers. No, say I can't. Mm -mm. So yeah, so we'll get the matchbox set out. Mm -hmm. We'll get these working. Okay. See so if I turn this. I'm looking in the motors and say, yeah, the motor's turning when I'm turning this. So I see some hairs and stuff, so it's gonna need taken apart and cleaned. Sorry, Mom. Oh. I didn't ask you about these. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, there's some hair in this well, one, you too. You talked to me about them, but 
That's it. No, I didn't talk to you about these. I uh, told you I needed to get parts for the other ones. But look how good a shape they're in. Yeah. So yeah, I'm not sure if these are like if the light lights up on this or not. So pretty cool, huh? Yep. So awesome. All right, monk. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got my thing off. I know, <laughs> but I just got too hot. Yeah, it's warming up. Thank goodness. We're so happy. It's getting warmer. Night before last, it was 33 degrees. Oh, we're not used to that cold weather. And a lot of people, you know, in Florida, well, they're I didn't mind down. it, you know. And they just, a lot of people were upset because it got too cold here. <laughs> but it's warming up. But I got these for 20 or 25 bucks. Yeah. Um, the police cars mm -hmm. are going for $27 a piece. Mm -hmm. I got this set for about that. Mm -hmm. Maybe 25 but yeah, I got both of them, so. There you go. Yeah. You got pretty, pretty good. Cool. So we have three tracks and we got one, just ordered one tonight. Yeah. While we were making this video. <laughs> I was telling her about it. Somebody... They wanted seventy nine ninety nine. They wanted eighty bucks for it. Yeah. It don't have controllers, but it does have cars. It's the Tyco Night Glow. And if it's all there, you can set it up the track four different ways. And uh, of course, I'm not worried about the controllers. You can still get the controllers there. For, they're pretty cheap, and we've got controllers. You know. Mm -hmm. So. So uh, I got. <laughs> I got a I got a message today and said because I had it on my watch list and they you know the message said that they had made me an offer mm -hmm. forty four ninety forty four forty four ninety nine forty five bucks mm -hmm. for that set instead of eighty bucks yeah and she was like forty five bucks. What do you want it? Just get it. <laughs> she wants another race track. Well, I mean, for that. Because, I mean, you get tired of them, you can always resell we didn't, these. Yeah, we them. didn't know, and they'll be in better shape. Mm-hmm. You know, Sweet. they'll be working when I sell them. Like, I paid up for this one. I paid 100 bucks for this. Yeah. Guy wanted 130. Mm-hmm. I put it on my watch list, and he came down to 109. I made him a counter offer of, I think, 90. Mm -hmm. And he made a counter offer on that and said 100. And I was like, man, you know? Yeah. Sure. Because <laughs> we didn't know if we wanted this one or the other one. And I, so I chose this one because it's the one I didn't have. I mean, I had the cliffhanger, but I didn't have the daredevil. This is the daredevil cliffhanger. It goes upside down, as you saw. So I was like, "Well, we'll go ahead and get this," mm -hmm. and uh, and it came with a car. I can fix the car. It just needs brushes, I think. You get the springs, the brushes, and the pickup shoes. The pickups. That's these pieces right here. Um, for like seven bucks. Mm -hmm. And that one, that car will be that car will be running. So, but yeah, we're gonna have what? One, two, three, four tracks. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. So yeah. sorry about the cars. But All right, no I, I couldn't say no to that. Right. I mean. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Monk, did you have fun? Yeah. We had to put the jump there because, well, I wanted that. You know, I wanted some more turns rather than just an oval, but I couldn't get the oval right. There was going to be a gap no matter what I did. And the instructions actually tell you, and none of this track is missing. It's all here. Every piece is accounted for. I made sure of that. And for some reason, there would be a gap. And I'm like, how? 
-hmm. it tells you in the instructions to do the oval first. Don't set it up right away like you see on the box. Get used to it because they want you to run your cars in 50 laps on this oval lap. When they're brand new, you got to run them in, you know. Right. Break them in. Mm -hmm. So I was like, I couldn't get an oval. And I'm like, what? So we came up with this, and then she's like, well, we'll, we'll just put a jump in it. I'm like, man, that's a hell of a gap. <laughs> so we put a jump in it. <laughs> Didn't we, Mama? Yeah. All right, so I got to get this picked up and boxed up. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Huh? Yep, my sister. Thanks for racing with me. You're welcome. If this was a real race, I think she would have beat me. I would have. Yeah, because her car was running faster. I'm just better. When they started going faster, you know, the track's getting better. It's kind of cleaning itself. Um, it, it was like, it was, I was doing my best to try to keep up with her. And then when I got to where I thought I was going to lap her, and then all at once, I don't know what she did, hit turbo or something. And <laughs> well, she passed me, and I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> That's why she likes the red car. But remember, I checked, they were the same speed. Yeah, yeah. But, and I was on the inside lane here. <laughs> so that's technically shorter. The inside's always shorter than the outside lane. But I put her on the outside because the guardrail, so she wouldn't fly off. But, you know, as you saw, that didn't help any. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I think she would have won if this would have been a real race. <clears throat> But next when, next time when we race, I'll figure out how to get this into an oval or something. or And uh, we won't have the jump in. We can just run. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, pretty cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Shea Bear, the Myth, the Man, the Legend. We're gone for now. Daredevil Cliffhangers. Get yours today. Offer void word prohibited by law. Monk. Okay, okay. <laughs> Bye, guys. We'll see you in the next Bye. one. <laughs> oh, stay tuned because we got parts coming for the pressure washer. Yes. Yeah, my buddy gave me that one pressure washer because remember I took the two and building one, he gave me the other one. Yeah. The one that had the bad pump. Yeah. So. so she said, why don't you get the stuff for that pressure washer? Because I said, I should get the stuff for it and sell it. She said, you should get the stuff for it and keep it. <laughs> we need one. I was like, all right, okay, that's true, we do, and that's 3,000 PSI, so. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Stay tuned for more awesome videos. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye, guys. Take care, Monk. Bye. <laughs>